What's up guys, it's Sunday Backyard Farmer. Now, I just got finished fishing and I still think there's enough time for me to get these peppers in the ground. So I've had them sitting over to the side for a week, letting them get, you know, hopefully not having pests on them, separating them from the rest of the stuff, just quarantining them. So I think I'm gonna go ahead and get this garden area over here, what I used last year. I think just need a little cleaning up. I think it's something that we can actually accomplish today. So I'll take you guys with me as always. So here we go. Coming with their dad to get some dirt. Say get some dirt. Nick here, say, get some dirt. Get some dirt. <laughs> some dirt. All right, guys, I know it does not look like much, but no time is better than right now. We got weeds. We got the old, all of these are the old um, peppers and banana peppers that was in this area over here. So we're gonna get this area cleaned out. Hopefully, let's see, let me step back. All right, so let me step back a little bit. So from this area, all the way to that corner was peppers. I may, I think I'm gonna do the same thing this year, but we're gonna concentrate more so on this area down here, ripping this stuff up and actually, um, don't have any extra soil to add but i do want to go ahead and get these hopefully i can add some amendments later but i just want to go ahead and get these in the dirt so let me show you what we're actually planting so these are things that if you has it been a week yet time been flying yeah it's been a week <laughs> these are the things that we got from savannah that i was getting garden shamed on so let me show you where they're sitting at. They're sitting on this table right here. We got these peppers that are pretty much ready to go. I feel like I'm missing. Oh yeah, I was about to say, I feel like I'm missing some stuff. We got some tomatoes that we're not gonna do today. We're just gonna focus on the peppers. Yeah, we're just gonna focus on the peppers for right now. So that area is clean. We're gonna try to actually do a lot closer planning this year so we can actually capitalize on the space that we got. So I will be planning closer than what I usually do. Um, we're just gonna see how many we can get in this area and go from there. So let me show you the area now. All right, so this is the area. We just pulled up the old stuff. Um, the soil is actually, it's actually not that bad. All right, so we can probably get, we we'll try to squeeze 10. Yeah, I'm gonna do one, two, three, four, then one in the middle, same thing and repeat. Let me move this. This is, my dad made this when I was a kid. So I just got it in the garden right now. Um, it's another one over on the other side I showed y'all before. So I'm gonna stop doing all this talking and we're gonna go ahead and get this stuff in the dirt. <laughs> Some dirt, people. <laughs> so guys, last year, this stuff was a mess. But last year, I did have some strawberries up here. Had some in here as well. This had runners. And actually, I did a video on using these runners and rooting them. I didn't get all of them. This one ran down here and established itself. So this is pretty much it for this area. 
Like I said, it's just going to be peppers. We'll see how it do. I still got to clean this area out. The weather hit a couple of times over here, so not sure how these um, brassicas is going to turn out. Put a candy cane pepper right here. And then I'll clean the rest of this stuff out and get ready for the rest of the stuff I'm putting over here. This got some cold weather damage. We're going to see if it pulls through. That one has some cold weather damage. I think the rest of them are pretty decent. That's it guys, I'm gonna get in this house, get something to eat. And so next time, you know what I want you to do? Let's get in some dirt. Some dirt. Later guys.